My name is Catherine and um, I am a wife. I have three kids. Um, I've been back in Bryan College Station for 11 years. I was here as a student and then left for a while and came back and started my family here. I'd heard of the ministry of UR Inc. for several years before my family um, experienced anything directly related with it. And the first way that we entered in was through King Camp. Um, my daughter attended for the first time when she was five years old. And at the end of King Camp, there's a time for the parents to come and watch what the girls had learned during those few days. Um, this gym full of little girls spoke this amazing blessing over um, the people who were watching and had a huge chunk of scripture memorized and um, expressed their worship through dance. It was just, it was incredible. I really felt the presence of the Spirit powerfully in that performance. The following spring decided that it was time for me to go to the conference. So even though I knew that it had happened for several years, um, I wanted to experience more of that. I went into the prayer room for the first time and that was a completely just sacred experience. Um, so I shared with my friend after the conference, man, I'm really glad you encouraged me to do that. It was amazing. And she said, well, you just need to go to living room sessions now. <laughs> it's this progression. And so um, I decided to apply to go to the living room sessions and did that just a few weeks ago. And I was probably equal parts nervous and excited, as I think probably most of the women were when you're entering into a space like that. I've shared with my husband and close friends that it has, was one of the most impactful weekends of my entire life. From the beginning, I felt very personally seen and I felt like I heard his voice in fresh ways that um, I didn't even realize I was hungry for until I was receiving it and um, just really felt this just abundant overflow of love over me as his daughter. And God just used all these women as his mouthpiece um, to over and over and over and over again throughout the weekend just continue to say i see you i love you there is more of me for you you can I've never ask for too much there were just several moments when i truly felt as if it was the lord like whispering these things into my ears and i think that the, the just the constancy of that it wasn't just one experience that i could go home and tell my husband or tell a friend about it was constantly just this this rolling wave that continued to wash over from the moment that I arrived until I left. Um, and I think even the ways that he continued that, you know, you can go to something like that and have some anxiety or some fear about what's going to happen when you leave this sacred place, you know, is it this experience that's isolated to a location or isolated to the group of people you're with, but he has been so kind um, to just continue to reinforce these messages of just abundance and love over me um, since I've gotten home. And I, I truly feel, I've said this to several friends, that short of my salvation, this has been one of the most impactful ways for me to recognize God's care for me, which is gonna empower me to extend true care to other people um, differently than I was before. I think that the Ministry of UR Inc. offers something really unique to Bryan College Station as God is speaking through this ministry and people are eager to hear what He has to say. It really is something that's just impacting entire generations um, in our community and beyond. And so if you do decide that um, this is something that would be a good, steward of your, a good way to steward your money, um, I think that you can just trust that it's not just a sweet little conference here in Bryan College Station. Um, it is really making a very far and wide reach for the spreading of the gospel.